Last week's gruesome murder of a former presidential aide, Ahmed Gulak Inoweri, has hiked the spate of insecurity in Imo State. Lawmaker representing Abombi Se Ngopala Federal Constituency is accusing the police and the military of indiscriminate killing and arrest of his people. National Assembly correspondent Joke Adisa reports. Hello. 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 Reactions have not stopped trailing the gruesome assassination of the APC chieftain Hamid Gulak on his way to the Sam Umbakwe airport located in Ngoakwala. Less than 24 hours after the murder, the police in Imo state announced it had traced and killed the suspected killers whom it identified as members of the proscribed IPOB and the Eastern Security Network. Almost at the same time, the state governor, Op Uzodema, described Ahmed Gulak's murder as a clear case of political assassination. They said ESL or the IPOM who killed Gulak has been killed. In the midst of the conflicting statements from the police and government authorities in the state, the member representing Ungo Akwala, where the airport is situated, is accusing security agencies of indiscriminately killing and arresting his people. He says his constituents have been killed while many have been hounded into the bush for fear of arrest. The military went to my constituency, Enyogu to be precise, destroyed shops owned by Nigerians, owned by my constituents, cutted away their goods. What have we done? What crime did we commit? The community has petitioned President Muhammad Buhari and security agencies demanding their intervention in 14 days. It is the duty and responsibility of the government to protect lives and properties. But what we cannot take is that you turn all of us from that region as criminals. We cannot take that because we are not. The lawmaker said he is at a loss as to reasons behind the arrest of his people when police authorities in the state have confirmed the recovery of rifles, pistol, ammunition and the vehicles allegedly used by the gunmen to kill the politician. Jokai Adisa, TVC News, Abuja.